What up, YouTube? It's your Lucy here. Universal has dropped its final trailer for the highly anticipated Halloween film, Halloween Kills. Now, here's of course what the uh, new Halloween is, um, is about. Minutes after Laura's trailer, her daughter Karen and granddaughter Allison left uh, Max Munster, uh, Michael Myers, Kate, and burning in Laurie's basement. Laurie is rushed to the hospital with life threatening injuries, believing she finally kills her lifelong tormentor. Uh, but when uh, Michael emerges to free himself from Laurie's trap, his ritual of bloodbath resumes as Laurie fights her uh, pain and prepares to defend herself against him. She prepares. She inspires all of Hoven Field to rise up against her unstoppable monster. The shrewd women uh, join a group of other survivors on Michael's first rampage, who decide to take matters into their own hands, forming a vigilante mob that sets out to hunt Michael down once and for all. Of course, it is really cool that we got to see like um, pretty much flashbacks of the OP characters, like a young Laurie Shrewd. We got to see uh, Tommy Doyle. Uh, we got to see Lindsay Walls. I think that you know uh, we even got to see the uh, one who played the. Uh, the one who played like the uh, um, the bully from uh, the original Halloween, he didn't even back. Um, I mean, yeah. Uh, of course, you know we got the uh, you know Halloween Kills, which is of course directed by David Gordon Green and stars the likes of Jamie Lee Curtis coming back as Laurie Schroeder, Judy Greer, uh, Andy Matichak, uh Anthony Michael Hall, uh, Dylan Honor, Robert Longstreet. Uh, Kyle Richards is coming back as um as Lindsay Wallace. Uh, we also got Nancy Stevens coming back as the uh, nurse as the uh, nurse uh, Marion Chambers. Uh, Charles Cyphers is also uh come back. Of course, uh, he actually played uh, Officer Bracken, who was like uh, Annie's uh, father in the original, which I think that's pretty cool that he's even come back. I am so much pumped for this. I thought this new trailer. Looks cool. It shows the bloodbath that we are going to be getting in this, and it looks like the uh, um there is a couple who are living in Michael's old house, so he decides to he doesn't want anyone living in the, his old house anymore. So he decides to uh, take matters into his own hands by killing this poor couple. I mean that's pretty messed up, Michael. Come on, dude. They didn't do nothing to you. But uh, that aside, I mean this does have yeah this does look like it does reveal a whole lot, but it does show what we already know that there is that there is pretty much like this man how. Men um, hunt out for Michael, and looks like he is probably going to be slaying loads of these people. I mean, from what I heard, this is supposed to be the most bloodiest bloodbath of the Halloween franchise. I mean, this is supposed to have the most kills of all the um, Halloween films. So, yeah, I'm definitely excited to check this one out. Uh, hopefully, it'll be as good as the first film, Fat Tour. Um, the 2018 one was really decent. So, looking forward to see where they're going to take this new one at. I mean, the original Halloween film is pretty much. Is an OG film. I always love the original Halloween. It's so creepy. It's so entertaining. So hopefully this new one will be as good. Anyway, Halloween Kills is set to hit both theaters and even Peacock on uh, October fifteenth. I'm seeing this in theaters. I'm sorry. I like Peacock. They had some pretty. It got some pretty good stuff. But this is a movie that's not for the big screen. So yeah. But anyway. Let me let you guys. What did you do on the final trailer for Halloween Kills? Did you like the new trailer? Are you looking forward to check Halloween Kills out? Have you ever been a fan of the Halloween franchise? Drop comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that bell for notifications. This is Sam Wizard.